you didn't sleep at all last night, huh? You didn't sleep. Four months sleep regression. I'm officially a mommy zombie. I'm so tired, guys. <laughs> Not funny. Mommy's so tired. What are you doing there? You're trying to get to school? <laughs> <laughs> Look at that smile. We're so tired. Hayden has not been taking it easy on us. This regression has been like. Alright, love you, Landon. Bye. home got the mail and some of Hayden's new clothes came because he's already in six month size so I actually have to go through a bunch of his like newborn and three-month clothes and I'm gonna list them on Mercari but here are some of the outfits <laughs> that I got for him that I thought were so cute like they looked like a beach <laughs> baby <laughs> kind of style and I like just like the one pieces to make it easy so I don't have to like buy separate pieces but this is his little six month wardrobe. So ever since I organized Hayden's closet, I've had a basket of clothes that he has already outgrown. Well, since Hayden decided to sleep right now, I've started decluttering some of my clothes too so that I can list them on Mercari as well with his baby clothes. And a huge thank you to Mercari for sponsoring today's video. So what I did was I kind of bundled some things together. So I'm gonna do like the Mickey outfits together the little brother outfits together. I have like three of these white onesies, the Valentine's Day outfit, and then this is sort of like a little neutral bundle that then I can list on Mercari. I have used Mercari a while. It's, I've mentioned some of my other videos too, but Mercari is a buying and selling app, and it's so easy. You can download the app right to your phone, and when you're decluttering stuff around your home, whether it is clothes, toys, home decor, there's a lot of like tech listed on there too. It's so easy just to snap pictures, list it on Mercari, and then you can make a little bit of money back on like the gently used or even sometimes like new items. You can find new items on Mercari. So it's also a great place for you to be buying things if you're looking for, you know, baby clothes, toys, really anything. Mercari's rule is if you can ship it, you can sell it. So easy, I can just go right to the Mercari app and click list an item and take a photo. So I'll do like this little Disney bundle. And so you just select the size and write the description of what everything is. And then you just set your price and click list and it is that easy. So now everything is listed on there and that took like no time at all. So it's just a really awesome tool for when you are decluttering things to be able to send them to a good home. And I will have in my description box the link to Mercari so that you can check out the website and download the app and it just makes it so simple and easy to take pictures, list the items you want to sell, you'll get a shipping label, and even if you don't have a printer, you can use UPS to still be able to like ship out your stuff. So Mercari makes it super easy. Again, check out the link below in my description box so that you can start using Mercari when you declutter your home. We've been on and off again and again. I don't know which way we're going. As much as I need caffeine today, I 
won't, but I just want like a real good coffee. <laughs> okay, so here's what I ordered. It is a grande white mocha, that's decaf. There's the label. And now I feel like I need to give like a life update on just, <laughs> obviously I feel like I've already complained multiple times. Hayden is not sleeping, therefore we're not sleeping, and it's been going on for like a week, and I honestly just wanna cry. Like, I'm so exhausted. It's it's really, really hard. So, I just, I feel like the four month sleep regression, I remember this with Prezi, just like crying about it. It's so hard if you're going through it to hugs. Like, there's really like, not a whole lot you can do like because they have to just kind of get like retaught how to fall back asleep and it just takes a while so i'm freaking exhausted i mean adam's exhausted too we're just a hot mess and then hot mess express continues because a couple of days ago now i think it was sunday yeah so it's been like four days i had a horrible like pain on my toe and adam looked he's like i think you have an ingrown toenail so we bought this over-the-counter stuff to put on it. By the next day, it had, this is so gross. It was like green and crusty and pussy. I've never had this happen before in my life. It was disgusting. And I called a podiatrist, that was yesterday. And she was like, I'm so sorry we can't get you in today, but I can get you in tomorrow morning. And I just pray there's something that they can do. Cause like I have to walk Presley into her school and I was like limping walking her in. Like it is so painful right now. And just on top of everything else, I'm just like, please like just let this go away. Like I want one less thing to have to worry about right now because the four month sleep regression is not a joke. It is, it is freaking awful. So give me a sign, give me a sign. Okay, I just got to the podiatrist, so I'm oh, just praying they can fix my foot. Where do we go from here? I wanna go all in. So give me a sign. was so messed up oh my god that hurt so bad like the doctor was so nice and I mean he finally made it super super numb but like while he was doing it oh my god it hurt so bad I just got back home and I feel like the numbing stuff they put on my toe is totally wearing off like okay it hurts so much so I got a bunch of stuff here I'll show you so I got the Epsom salt to like soak it and then Neosporin to put on it to hopefully keep the infection away and then these band-aids I got because they say infection defense too and then it says that I can take Tylenol so I'm going to try to take it right now but literally like half of my toenail is gone. Like I don't know if my toe is ever gonna even look normal ever again. Ugh, and it just hurt so bad. And he said like, I cannot go to the beach or like hiking, nothing like that. He said probably like four to five days and definitely like don't go in the water for like as long as it takes for this to heal up. It's just like, this just sucks. It sucks. <laughs> Why? Oh, it hurts. I feel like I can't think normally when I'm like in pain and have no sleep. Like I'm just like, oh my God. I love you. Yeah? Look at your perfect little toes. You're so perfect. Mommy's is all messed up, huh? Yeah. Yeah. And now this. I, I literally was in my head. I was like, I don't think it could get any worse. Now there's a tsunami watch. Like, 
oh my god. I'm just going to pray. Like, I just need to pray right now. Now I'm scared. I'm exhausted, I'm in pain, and I'm scared, and I just want to cry. Yeah, I, it, it's a watch, so that means there isn't one, but there's a potential for one. A warning means there is a tsunami. Okay. Uh, yeah. The property manager just texted me about the tsunami watch. Should we be, like, but would you be, recommend we be prepared to evacuate? She hasn't responded yet. It was one of three major earthquakes off New Zealand. Yeah, New Zealand, everyone has to move immediately to the highest ground. Oh my God. And we're like in the red zone. I mean, literally, I feel like just to be on the safe side, you should go get gas like right now, just to make sure that like the van is ready to go. Okay, yeah, it's low. It was like a quarter tank when All we just right. got back. So, and we'll have to get the kids from school. Yeah, should pack food. So. Oh, you think this is funny? This is not funny. He thinks every like time that like I'm upset, he laughs. He thinks everything's funny. <laughs> He's laughing right now. We're not. This is not funny. All right, but so they are not funny. No. To this map on our website, kitv.com. A hazard, not an It's just new right now. Yeah. Um, can you talk about that a little bit? Dang it, I just wish that I hadn't had this thing happen with my toe because now it's hurting so bad. I don't know how I'm going to hobble around and do this. I mean, it was all like localized. Like, he did shots all around my foot, but now that it's like wearing off, it is literally just like throbbing in pain. And I took Tylenol too. And if you do have to live where you're in danger, then you Well, they said I should take Tylenol, so I took like the maximum dose I could of the Tylenol. But first arrival of the first tsunami wave is 4.35 p.m. here in Hawaii, and so there's lots of time to prepare. Just canceled for Hawaii. Thank, Thank God. Hey, Brenton, we can all just take a moment of relief, but of course, it's a great reminder. Okay, we should be out of the clear for the tsunami, hopefully. According to that, they said it is canceled. It's still like super scary. Why does it feel like the world is just, I don't know. I just don't remember all of this stuff happening when we were kids, but. Hi. Hi there. Guess what? The tsunami watch got canceled got canceled so we don't have to worry as much okay well we just made it through our first tsunami watch huh was that scary or did you just think it was funny did you just think it was funny hey hey oh are you still not tired at least you got some lunch was your lunch good was your lunch good what oh, was lips those lips. <laughs> oh, I love you. Went home from school, and what did she bring her mama? Chocolate. Chocolates. We cheer them. Cheers. <laughs> Keep running in the woods. So Look on the TV. Look on the TV. Look at that tsunami. What? I did a tsunami dive. Oh, tsunami dive. Let's not joke about tsunamis today, okay? Tsunami dive. Yeah, mommy tsunami. Dive into tsunami. Yeah, mommy doesn't want to be diving into any tsunamis, okay? I'm gonna dive into one. No, you're not. Prezi, what are you doing? I'm falling like this. Here go! Oh my god. <laughs> doing, hey, hey. Do you have a good nap? Are you gonna sleep better tonight for us, please? Mommy? Please. Mommy? Mommy? Yes, baby. Is this how bad more saving it? Put it up! Okay. That's how 
super easy dinner recipe. It's very similar to one that I shared in I think like my first cleaning video in this house. But this has become a staple. Adam requests this or that dinner every single week, usually at least once a week. I'm making some form of this. But this is going to be a one pan chicken teriyaki. So I have green pepper, a red onion that has been cut up and a container of mushrooms that I just sliced in half. So it's kind of like deconstructed chicken kebabs too. So when I made this in the last video, I used steak and instead of chicken, but you can totally use pork for this as well. So it makes it kind of nice that you can sort of like use whatever meats you have on hand and you can totally change up the veggies too. So you can use potatoes in this recipe if you're looking for a starch. We've just been trying to eat low carb as much as possible or you can make rice for on the side when you serve this. If you know, you're looking for something to make it like for your kids and they need their carbs or you could put this in tortillas and it would be really, really good too. I'm using the same Sweet Baby Ray's sweet teriyaki sauce, but really you can use any kind of sauce or marinade that you like for this. If you want to use Italian dressing or any other kind of like steak and chop marinade, just depending on what kind of meat you're using. But I'm just going to drizzle this like heavily all over the meat because you really want it to be thick so probably like a third of the bottle on the meat and then I'll just do like a very tiny drizzle across the top of the other veggies just to give them a little bit of a drizzly flavor and then I'm gonna pop this in the oven it is at 350 degrees Fahrenheit sorry I don't know if you could hear that 350 degrees and put it in for one hour so here is the finished one pan chicken teriyaki. Again, it's so easy, just in the oven for an hour at 350 degrees. If you're new here, I did publish my first cookbook last fall, so be sure to check that out if you're interested in more recipes, but I will continue to try to share any new recipes that I'm making with you guys as well on my channel. So if you're into kind of some new recipes, be sure to check out some of my other videos because I usually try to include at least one recipe in almost all of my videos. I watch you as you drive. Smile. Do you know how much I love you? You put my favorite song on. I put my feet up, and we just sing along. And I can't help but feeling just loving this moment. Can we stay here forever? I'm loving this moment. Can we stay here? The Pete Presley. If I could stop the time. So oh, good. the color chalk on you it's supposed to just be on the ground oh my god Presley stop oh my gosh you're gonna have a bath tonight now oh my goodness gracious it's a long day on that note I'm gonna end the vlog here thanks again for watching make sure you're subscribed and we'll see you in the next video aloha I can't watch you wait forever. I'm loving this moment. Can we stay here?